Hi, welcome to the channel. I'd like to do something a little different. Um, we've gained a lot of subscribers, so I'd like to see if everybody that watches the video just take two seconds and just write where you're from. I think it'd be pretty interesting. I think my kids would really enjoy it. Thanks. Welcome to this week's video. first closet that we framed up. We're just framing exterior walls up. Let's say it's going well. This one window took me one whole day. A lot of pictures here mostly because I didn't take any video. I was just trying to concentrate and, and make these walls as square and plumb as level as I could. Just didn't really have time to explain. You still get to watch the process. There's that closet. And the Tyvek goes all the way up to where you can see. This, uh, this is where my ceiling's gonna be, obviously. And then I'm in the attic space. See how I pulled that Tyvek up? Almost, I bet you it's three feet. So that way, this is all gonna be spray foamed up here. I'm gonna sheath this whole top of this with wood. That way, when he sprays, it's gonna be two inches of continual spray. The other option, you put sheetrock on the ceiling, right, from down below, and then you spray in between each bay. This chipboard, I think it's a half inch. It might be three quarter inch, it's heavy. And I gotta get it up there at the angle, the right angle. Oh God. That was one of 20. This will be up here. I'll sheet the whole floor like this. And then the spray foam is gonna go, two inches of foam will go right on this, right to that side, and then it'll go down and connect with the other spray foam. And then on top of the spray foam, I'm gonna have 18 inches of blown insulation. That way too, I don't know if this is good or not. I don't have time to do my wiring before I gotta get this foamed because we're getting into um, September. So right here, if I do this, I'll be able to run my wires um, inside these bays. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'll be able to run my wiring all inside these bays and hopefully get some recessed lighting to fit inside of a six inch bay. I'm sure they make that. I won't have any actual wiring in the attic, which I feel like is a good idea. Um, obviously, if you have a problem with the wiring, it's gonna be in the ceiling, but you shouldn't have a problem with it. Um, what would be nice is if you're ever up in the attic and you're walking around, you won't have to worry about stepping on a wire. You won't have to worry about like rodents getting, I don't know. Is it better? I don't know. Probably not. I had to call in a favor with Sarah to help me get all this wood up there. You hear a bat or something? I was just mid cut thinking I'm gonna have like 20 bats rushing me. I just ruined a piece of wood or I'm a genius. I would say, damn, nice cut. <laughs> <laughs> Again, right above the stair. We're going to end this video with a lot of pictures, um, just so you can see it. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next week for the next video. Remember to show and like the video.